Hey YouTube, what's up? It's your girl, A Plus Fun, and welcome back to The A Plus Show. And today, I just want to do a collective haul over some things that I've gotten, oh my gosh, over the past months. Like, I've been waiting. If you guys watch my other videos, you know that I moved. Excuse me. Okay, let me turn the ring off on my phone. So yeah. I got some things from Just Fab, Ulta, some things, I don't know. I just have them all sitting right here and I'm just going to pick them up and get right into the haul. So the first, um, first I want to start with Just Fab. Uh, I got this purse here and as you can see I haven't worn it yet. And I really like it because I love this color. I really think that it looks good on my skin tone. Although I do not like this color in lipsticks. Let me let that be known. I don't like this color when it comes to putting on my lips. But um, it's very nice. It's so stylish. You have your little gold buckle here. And on the bottom you have the gold uh, ball. So when you, you know, put your purse down, it's not just sitting flat on the surface. Helps it keep um, from getting dirty. We also have gold hardware here on the bag. In the back it has a zipper that also has gold hardware on it. Now let's open it up. Let's see, I haven't opened it at all. So first thing I see is a strap. So just in case you want to make it longer, it does have a strap that you can use there. Next I see paper. Oh my gosh, it's like really, really spacious. So here's the inside of the bag. And there is pocket, two pockets here. Both of them are like wide enough to fit maybe your cell phone in. Uh, then it has a, uh, a zipper part here in the middle. And then another zipper part here at the top. As you can see, it is very wide and spacious. And one of the reasons I hadn't carried it yet is because I thought it was like too narrow, too small for like an everyday purse. But I am really, really wrong. It's extremely spacious inside. So let's see if it has the name of it on it. Well, on this tag it says Handbag Ram Mercy Coral. So I don't know if that's what it's called or not. I don't know. But yeah, this is another fabulous Just Fab purchase. Okay, my next purchase that I want to show you a pair of shoes. Haven't worn these yet either. They're so cute. Booyah! Look at this, y'all. This is like the perfect, perfect combina combination. I absolutely love it. And I like how the heel, it has like the platform at the bottom to make that just extra sexy. So yeah, I think these are like going to look gorgeous on my feet. I got them in a size 7, I believe. But yeah, so I haven't worn these yet either, but I'm so looking forward to it. And sad part about it is it does not match with this purse. Oh, that's a bummer. That would have been like the perfect combination. Pair with some jeans and a nice little shirt, and I would have been in there like swimming. Now I got to wait still to wear them. Alright, so one of my most recent buys is from Lash Craze. Finally, I got the Natural Beauty. And I think these are um, the ones that Lover for, Love for Fashion or Lover for Fashion promotes. And this is what they look, look like. And I also have them on, so that's why one pair is missing. But they were having a sale. You got them for like 20% uh, off. So I really jumped on that because I am a huge supporter of Lash Craze Lashes. And it came in a box wrapped in this cute little tissue paper. Isn't it cute, you guys? I can do it. Keep that and wrap something up. Uh, the next one I got was Big Mama. And I like these because they were like extremely full. So. Um, whenever I'm looking for a bold, dramatic look, I probably um, double these up and just really, really put that oomph and that focus like dead on my eyes. So, I've never tried this style, nor have I ever tried Natural Beauty. At least I don't think I have. I might have. I don't know. I've tried so many. But, 
I don't think I have, but who knows. But I know for a fact I've never tried Big Mama. I uh, also got a Barbie Girl. And I don't know if I ordered these or if they just sent this as like a extra little incentive. I don't know. But I'm excited to wear them because they do what I love for lashes to do. And that is start off. They start off small on the inside and they elongate as they get towards the outer corner. I just love uh, falsies that do that. That just really, really excites me. So yeah, these are called Barbie Girl and I know for a fact I've never worn this style from Lash Crates. Okay, next I'm going to reach into my Ulta bag. I had a coupon with Ulta as well, so... I got the NYX, the Curve, and Jet Black. And this is what it looks like here. And it's an eyeliner. It has a very, very fine tip. Um, they say that it's really, really good for helping you create a wing liner. Um, I have a real severe fold in the corner of my eye. So, I don't know. Maybe this will help me um, with creating wing eyeliner looks. You know, I don't know probably nothing will help me because the fold is just not going anywhere so yeah the nyx curve eyeliner and it comes in this huge box it's probably why they charge you so much you know they just put it in this big box next thing i got from ulta is the nyx eyebrow marker okay the box just fell on the floor and i don't feel like getting it so yeah this is what it looks like outside of the box and this is the tip of it. It's very fine as well. I tried to use this. Um, when I first tried to use it, it was a, a disaster because my hands were not sturdy enough. And then on top of, top of that, my eyebrows really do need to be arched. So, yeah, I got it in um, deep. It's the color. We'll see how this works out. Hopefully it does. Moving along before my camera dies, I got a beauty blender sponge, and I think I just got this from like Walgreens. Yeah, so I love the beauty blender. Uh, NYX eyebrow eye pencil slash eyebrow pencil in white curl, and this is great for like the inner corners and just uh, you want to make your eyes up here wider dog it i broke it <laughs> yeah okay so if you want to make your eyes i might as well just take it off up here wider and more open more open yeah that's the better word than wider then this is perfect used it once left it okay okay trying to hurry trying to hurry i hate this y'all this is the uh, maybelline color whisper in 40 orange attitude like I wanted an orange because I had tried max orange and I loved it you put that on like with some gold jewelry it looks amazing so I caught myself trying to find like a cheaper version save me some money this mess here it is like so light like it barely looks like you have anything it's not a bold color like the one from mac is so yeah i was very disappointed and then it just feels like a lip balm it doesn't feel like a lipstick at all it's very soft and creamy i have worn this i don't like it so what i'm going to do is try to locate a orange liner to help intensify the color but yeah, that's what it looks like. That's not orange. I don't know what that is. It's, it's like baby orange. It's not grown up orange. Uh, got a new Maybelline Vivid in Hot Plum. Love this one. I think I have it on. Yeah, I think I do. I don't know. But yeah, this is Hot Plum. And these Vivids are like very vivid. And they last like for hours and they are like super soft and creamy so yeah bump the whispers get the vivids and if you already have them stick with the vivids don't waste your money on the whispers a mac a while ago and i got the uh charge water this is my first time using this one i've always used just a regular white one i forgot what it's called fix spray plus fix plus whatever um i like this one better i've used it um 
for probably about a month now and yeah like it better to me it's more effective at refreshing your face than the other one so yeah that's what i use it for and i also like before i put on my liquid foundation i'll miss my face or i'll miss the brush and dip it in the foundation and you know it just kind of adds like an extra glow to your foundation love it I don't know what this is, but I picked it up at Ulta because I had a coupon. But it is Under Eye Dark Circle Serum by Reviva, Reviva, I don't know. And it's a breakthrough for severe dark circles. I have severe dark circles mainly because they're just hereditary. So I'm going to start using this to see what it does. And you can use this like under your eye cream or eye makeup. And you can use it at bedtime. Um... And you could just wear it alone. It doesn't matter. So I'm um, thinking it says it reduces the capillary leakage of hemoglobin. Now found to be a major cause of dark dark circles. I think my majority of times just I need to take my butt back to sleep. I sleep, but I need more than just your average bear. So yeah, I'll let you guys know. And if anyone has ever tried this before, let me know. Let me know. Let me know. Okay, so a friend of mine actually my brother's girlfriend told me about these she actually used it on my mom to help my mom um do her eyebrows and these are the maybelline define a brow eyebrow pencil so i got this in light brown which is the correct color that i'm supposed to use as you can see i mean i purchased trying to figure out which one was the correct color because so i want the same color that she used so i end up getting a light blonde too too light and then I have a light brown and then I have another light brown because I couldn't find the other light brown I thought I had left it at my mom's house so I got another one so now I have all of these um, they work really really well and they're a good um, affordable way to uh, go ahead and define uh, draw your brows fill them in versus using like Mac because it's a little bit more expensive these work just as well and they are cheaper the only thing I found I had a problem with the light blonde was that it was so dry you know they're light colors again it's just like light hair it's just dry and every time I try to use it, it just break 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 so I'm probably just gonna throw it away but I wanted to just um, keep it to share with you guys and remind you well remind me to tell you that yeah I would probably stay away from the light blonde because it, it was just dry I don't know maybe it was just old I don't know but it, every time I touch my skin with it it breaks waste of money waste of time but the other ones love them good investment pick this up from NYX and it's pale pink and um that is what it looks like it's a very pale pink so yeah, I just picked this up to kind of like uh, have a neutral type pink, if that makes sense, to line my lips when I wear my uh, pink lipstick. So, always a fan of NYX lip liner. Last but not least is my Mary Kay cosmetic bag. Ordered this um, Mary Kay. I am a Mary Kay beauty consultant, so I ordered uh, this for myself to house all my cosmetics in my purse so yeah I just thought it was like really really cute and it's just a way for me to um put it out there um that I do sell Mary Kay and do facials and things like that you know inside I have my Mary Kay lip balm thank you guys for watching follow me on Instagram Twitter and then you know all the things that I bought and I forgot the haul I always take a picture of them um, over time and place them on Instagram. Also, check out my A Plus Fun uh, Facebook page. And all of the links to those will be down below. And I'm also now on Keek. So, yeah, I haven't Keek as of yet, but I'm on there. I'm going to get to it. All right.